Rachel Riley has been awarded £50,000 in damages after winning a libel claim against a political blogger over an article claiming she was a serial abuser. The Countdown star launched legal action after Michael Sivier published an article on his website Vox Political in January 2019 with the headline Serial Abuser Rachel Riley to receive extra protection dash on grounds that she is receiving abuse. The article discussed tweets posted as part of an online debate on anti-Semitism in the Labour Party, some of which were exchanged between Ms Riley and a user who identified herself as a then 16-year-old called Rose, in December 2018 and January 2019. A judge previously found that Mr. Sivier's article would be read as claiming Ms. Riley engaged upon, supported and encouraged a campaign of online abuse and harassment of a 16-year-old girl, allegations denied by Ms. Riley. During the trial at the High Court in London in July, Ms. Riley said the amount of abuse she received increased significantly from January 9, 2019, describing it as horrendous. Mr. Sivier defended the claim by arguing he had a reasonable belief it was in the public interest to publish the claims in the article. However, in a judgment on Wednesday, Mrs. Justice Stein ruled in favor of Ms. Riley granting her the five-figure sum in damages as well as an injunction requiring Mr. Sevier to remove the article and not repeat it. The judge said Mr. Sevier had misrepresented the evidential picture and that the article was wholly unbalanced. Mrs. Justice Stein said the blogger did not include any references to Ms. Riley's denial of the allegation that she had bullied or encouraged the bullying of the 16-year-old and did not give the television presenter a chance to comment. She said, it was not reasonable for Mr. Sevier to assume, without giving any reason for his belief, that Ms. Riley would not comment, rather than provide her with an opportunity to do so. The importance of giving Ms. Riley an opportunity to comment prior to the publication of the article is particularly evident in light of the numerous matters on which Mr. Sevier made assumptions. Mrs. Justice Stein said, whether or not one agrees with the views Ms. Riley articulated in her second thread to Rose, Ms. Riley expressed herself in a polite and cordial way providing information to a teenager who had sought to engage with her, and who had said this was a topic about which she was just learning. Ms. Riley expressed the point that she found it hurtful to be accused of lying and encouraging a smear campaign in restrained and mild terms. The blogger had originally defended the libel claim on the grounds of truth and honest opinion as well as public interest. In January 2021, Mrs. Justice Collins Rice struck out all three of Mr. Sivier's defenses, finding that they had no prospect of succeeding. However, Mr. Sivier won a challenge at the Court of Appeal four months later, finding that his public interest defense should be assessed at a trial. In today's ruling, Mrs. Justice Stein said she had no hesitation in finding that the statement complained of was not only untrue, it was not even arguably true. She continued, there has been no retraction, amendment or apology to mitigate the damage to the claimant's reputation or to provide any element of vindication. The award of damages, together with this judgment, will have to provide that.